Now we're going to log in to the AMZ Global Keywords tool. So just logging in. And now we can see that we've logged in. And now we're going to do a search on Amazon.co.uk. And what we're also doing is we're setting the competitor ASIN. So this is one of the ASINs that we've actually picked, which already ranks for kids craft kits and as you can see we're now setting the file and the folder that we want all the results to be saved under. You can see on here the number of keywords that we found initially so this system goes off to a number of places including SEMrush in order to um, take your seed keyword and actually expand it and then it goes over to Amazon, um, the particular Amazon country that you want and then expands it using um, using Amazon to give you all of the key phrases that people have actually typed into in this case Amazon.co.uk when searching for something similar to what you're actually searching for. So these are key phrases that are related to our um, seed key phrase of kids craft kits. Now what we're doing is we're going and we're expanding these and you can see that um, we're now testing each one of these to see if the ASIN, the competitor ASIN that we've got, actually ranks within the first page, so within the first 10 results on Amazon.co.uk and you can see us kind of flying through those at the moment and you can see how many key phrases we've actually pulled out to start with. So we'll forward the video and um, come back once it's actually finished. Now we've finished and what you'll see happens is it says finished and you get an OK. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go over to Excel and we're going to import that file, that CSV file. So I've hidden other things um, for various reasons. So we're going to import it and as we've talked about we've got um, everything is delimited by pipe so we just import it using the pipe as a separator pull it in all there and then we've got three columns the first column is key phrases the second one is whether or not um, the ASIN the competitor ASIN we had actually ranks for that key phrase on Amazon on the first page of Amazon.co.uk and the third one is the number of results so the number of products that actually rank on Amazon.co.uk as of today for that particular key phrase obviously we've tied it up a little bit as you can see we're sorting it by the number two on column B so rank and these, obviously, the top key phrases on the left-hand side um, are the ones that your competitor ASIN already ranks for. So they already ra already rank for those on page one of, of Amazon.co.uk. And what we've done now is we've gone over to Amazon, we've taken one of our key phrases, and just to prove that, obviously, the um, competitor ASIN actually ranks on page one for that key phrase on Amazon.co.uk, uh, here you can see it and we'll do the same thing again we've got a two in that um, ranking column and only a few results on this particular one as you can see the result number is exactly the same on Amazon and again you can see the competitor ASIN uh, so the uh, this particular product that actually ranks on page one on Amazon.co.uk for that key phrase which means you could now use those for your PPC and also for your Amazon PPC and also um, to optimize your um, particular product page with so that you can actually rank organically for those phrases as well.